How's it going y'all? In today's video, we're gonna be busting Grace Whitney, most wanted target in GTA Online. We're also gonna be stealing her paintings for that extra bonus cash reward, which I'm gonna show you how to do this as well as the bonus reward, how much you're getting right at the end of this video. So right when the mission starts, Mod Eccles will call you and you need to be going to the morgue to check for a dead body to see whether it's really Grace Whitney or not. We're able to do this because Mod Eccles' boyfriend is working at the hospital or the mock area. So once you arrive there, you just have to take out the guard and get inside. There'll be two more guards, take them down, and then you have access to the body. All you have to do now is just pull your camera, snap a picture, and send it over to Jeanette. Jeanette will confirm the identity of the disease, which happens to be not Grace Whitney. So we're now heading over to her gallery. So now you just have to exit the hospital and then you can skip all the guards, especially if your bounty van is using armor plating. Pretty much you can ignore most of the AI that are shooting at you. Once you arrive at the parking lot, take out two guards and then take the elevator up. The layout of this building is similar to your CEO office parking garage. So basically all you have to do is just clear the guards. You can do it in stealth or aggressive. It doesn't really matter because once you reach the upper floors, the alarm's gonna be sounded anyways. As you can see here, Whitney is waiting there at the stairs and as soon as you pass this location, she'll spot you and sound the alarm. So all you have to do is just clear all the guards. And now let's talk about the bonus rewards. So you'll either get this message at the top right of your screen that says steal the painting for a cash reward if the target is delivered successfully or sometimes Jeanette will let you know through the voice call. So all you have to do is just find the painting, which is located on the wall on the right here. However, you'll be needing a bag, otherwise it'll say a bag is required to steal the painting. The bag is just located right opposite of the painting, right on top of this crates. So you wanna pick up the bag and then pick up the painting. You also have to, of course, cut out the painting like you always do in Kyabriko Heist or the Diamond Casino Heist. Just press the directional buttons accordingly to get the painting. Then you want to go upstairs, clear some more AI guards, and head inside of the elevator to reach the rooftop. Once you're up there, there'll be more AI guards that you have to clear, and also two choppers, so you want to be taking down those two choppers just be extra careful because sometimes those choppers might land on top of Whitney, which will make you fail the mission of getting her alive. So once you cleared all the AI, if you don't have a stun gun here, you can actually shoot at her arms and her weapon will actually fly off here. Let's see this again in slow motion. So if you don't have the money to spend on the agency or the gun van is just not selling the stun gun that we, you can always use this method. Alright, now she's on the ground, just get closer to her and press the right d-pad or interact key and you'll be capturing her into your bail office van which you have to drive her back to your bail office. So the bonus rewards for this painting is not that much as you expected, it's just additional 5,000 GTA dollars. So that's it for today's video, thank you so much for watching, if you find this video useful, be sure to hit that like and also subscribe to the channel for more future GTA videos. This is Joe and I'll see you next time.